Welcome back to the Millie Jackson Channel. The race for the fastest cars is always a desperately tight and never-ending one. Top car makers effortlessly invest a huge sum of money and resources and research to produce supercars, manifesting their cutting-edge technology, and again, they all throw themselves in the rat race to seek the halo of glory. So what supercars are the fastest on the top 10 list? Fasten your seatbelts and join with the Millie Jackson channel to discover who they are in this video. Number 10, W Motors, the Fenrir Supersport. This W Motors supercar finds its source of inspiration in Fenrir, a giant wolf in the Northern European mythology whose power is so brutally overwhelming that it takes the entire weight of the earth to harness him. The lightweight carbon fiber and graphene composite body are aerodynamically optimized with bold cutting lines, exuding an aura of aggressiveness as the name suggests. Thus, the car weighs just as much as 1.2 tons, paired with a 3.8 liter horizontally opposed six-cylinder engine from Rook, transmitting power through the seven-speed dual-clutch transmission to generate 800 horsepower and a maximum torque of 980 newton meters. This hostile Wolf reaches a maximum speed of 399 kilometers per hour, thanks to aluminum discs and Pirelli P0 tires. The automaker announced that only 110 editions will be marketed at $1.9 million each. Number 9. The Aston Martin Valkyrie This is the company's first hypercar. Valkyrie is the god in Northern European mythology who seeks and recruits the most powerful warriors. And 150 road cars, Aston Martin Valkyries are representatives for its core values. At $3.5 million each, all cars are already pre-ordered, with delivery expected by the end of this year. Its strength like a warrior comes from the 6.5-liter V12 naturally aspirated engine developed by Cosworth and the electric system by Rimac. The body is entirely made of rigid carbon fiber, with a design closely resembling an F1 racing car in thin front end, muscular wheel arches, extended back end that complies with the Venturi principle to make the most of airflow caused by pressure differential. Therefore, it is highly efficient in reducing drag and increasing pressure on the road. With a golden power to weight ratio 1 to 1, 1160 horsepower to 1100 kilograms, the vehicle can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 2.5 seconds and travel at a maximum speed of 402 kilometers per hour. Number 8. The Koenigsegg Regira With its 25-year history and just over 200 employees, the mechanical genius Christian von Koenigsegg has created the world-class hypercar, constantly breaking previous records. Specifically, it is the maximum speed of 404 kilometers per hour and especially the unbeaten world record, noting that the vehicle can accelerate 0 to 400 kilometers per hour, then quickly come to a standstill in 31.49 seconds. This record also breaks the record set by its brother Aguera, made at 33.29 seconds, and surpasses the Bugatti Chiron by more than 10 seconds. This is largely thanks to the replacement of a traditional gearbox with the Koenigsegg direct drive transmission, along with the hybrid drive system, including a 5-liter bi-turbo V8 engine and three electric motors that produce 1,500 horsepower and a maximum torque of 2,000 newton meters. Besides, the system for automatically controlling, lifting frame, and the front rear spoiler is also the very first initiative ever, which takes advantage of aerodynamics. Number 7, the Bugatti Veyron Supersport. A major player in this race to fastest supercar title is Bugatti, a French auto manufacturer. In 2010, the Bugatti Veyron Supersport made its way into the Guinness Book for a world record speed of 430.07 km per hour. Undoubtedly, achieving this required a host of breakthroughs. 
First, Veyron's eight liter W16 engine with four large turbochargers and an internal cooling system produced 1200 horsepower and a maximum torque of 1500 newton meters, all of which are impressive figures at the time. Second, the Supersport monocoque chassis is made of carbon fibers, which helps reduce the vehicle's weight to the maximum. 10 years ago, customers had to pay a sky-high price of $2.4 million for any of the 30 limited editions available to the market. Today, the collectible price could be beyond imagination. Number six, the Hennessy Venom GT. In 2014, on the 3.2 mile runway of the Kennedy Space Center, intended for the space shuttle, the Hennessy Venom GT surpassed the Challenger, the Bugatti Veyron Supersport, to reach a maximum speed of 435.31 kilometers per hour. Hennessy, an American tuning company for high-performance cars, remade the Venom GT, which is based on the Lotus Elise prototype, and sold only 13 units for $1.25 million each. The reason why it didn't earn a spot in the Guinness World Records is that the book requires more than 30 editions to make it count. The company revealed that the Venom GT Spider version employs a 7-liter V8 supercharged engine that produces 1,451 horsepower and a maximum torque of 1,745 newton meters. That power is transferred through Ricardo's six-speed manual transmission, Michelin Pilot Sport 2 tires, and a 2.4-inch suspension lift adjustable to the speed. Number five, the Koenigsegg Agera RS. Introduced to the Geneva 2015, the Agera RS is the product inheriting some of the most advanced and unique technologies from the Koenigsegg One's research program. For maximum speed, the weight reduction is one of the car maker's top priorities. So, the car has a body completely made of super lightweight carbon fiber, a carbon fiber frame with an aluminum honeycomb core structure, or super hard carbon ceramic brakes, and the first seven speed dual clutch transmission that features only one input shaft and weighs only 81 kilograms. But to increase traction, the body is optimized aerodynamically to work with the rear spoiler to create a pressure force of 485 kilograms when running at 250 kilometers per hour. Moreover, achieving a maximum speed of 447 kilometers per hour and a maximum torque of 1,360 horsepower requires the power of a 5-liter V8 twin-turbo aluminum engine with four valves per cylinder. Number four, the SSC Tuatara. First known nearly a decade ago, after many delays, the hypercar SSC Tuatara has been refined by the hands of Jason Castriota, designer of many models for Ferrari and Maserati. Now, it is ready for delivery to the customer. With a sharply pointed front, muscular rear, and a design inspired by the fighter jet, the SSC runs ahead like an arrow, with an extremely low wind resistance coefficient of 0.279 while other vehicles in this list are above 0.3 on average. Its dry weight is only 1,247 kilograms, thanks to the carbon chassis and body structure. The heart of SSC lies in a V8 6.9 liter twin turbocharged engine with a flat plane crank. The power is transmitted through a CIMA seven speed transmission with the ability to trigger gear changes under 100 milliseconds, producing an unprecedented power of 1,750 horsepower when using ethanol biofuel E85 and reaching a maximum speed of 483 kilometers. That said, it is worthy of a $1.9 million price tag. Number three, the Hennessy Venom F5. The Hennessy Venom F5 is named after the F5 tornado, the most devastating tornado by the Fujita scale with a speed of 420 to 512 kilometers per hour. Indeed, the vehicle coming out after five years of research by engineers from Hennessy and Pennzoil rose to become the fastest car in the world at that time, with a maximum speed of over 484 kilometers per hour. Thus, it has unquestionably become an icon of American mechanical engineering. 
F5 looks sleek and youthful outside and strong inside. The most notable feature is the 6.6-liter twin-turbo V8 aluminum-forged engine with stainless steel cylinders. The frame and body are made entirely of carbon with an extremely strong anti-twisting hardness of 52,000 newton meters per degree resulting in the chassis weight of only 86 kilograms. Number two, the Bugatti Chiron Supersport 300 Plus. It's another supercar from Bugatti. The company has tweaked a bit from the Chiron version that once set a record of 490 kilometers per hour. The name 300 Plus seems to assert that Bugatti will never impose a limit on a car. Still loyal to its iconic design, this version sees the wider and extensive body that allows for airflow through the surface longer, thus making a greater gap between the airflows and striking a perfect balance between low drag and downforce for enhanced performance and stability. The commercial version is powered by its Hallmark W16 8-liter engine, with four turbochargers producing 1,578 horsepower. To attain the speed of 490.48 km per hour on the Era Lessland test track, the commercial version only needs to remove the speed reducer and add an anti-roll bar. Number 1. The Koenigsegg Jesko Absolute This is truly the pinnacle of Koenigsegg's mechanics as well as the world. I bet many of you are fast-tracking this video just to have a look at it. The CEO, Christian von Koenigsegg, claims it can run at a mind-blowing speed of 532 kilometers per hour. Do you think that it's merely an advertising trick? Please leave your comments and have a say on it. The first special thing is that it only requires a standard set of rubber tires for every speed. Next is the 5-liter twin-turbo V8 engine, 9-speed light-speed automatic transmission with the ability to change gears in almost no time. What's more, the dampers and springs are much softer. Triplex suspension for front wheels is removed. It is equipped with two standing rear twin fins based on the F-15 fighter model. Due to the removal of the front bumper, the hood air intakes, and the front wheel cavity, the total weight is reduced to only 1,320 kilograms. Everything is optimized and perfect with the Yesco Absolute. A short video is not enough to express all the best of the 10 super fast cars. To me, they're more of a masterpiece. Please like and share if there's more to them than meets the eye. And drop a comment as a contribution to our better videos next time.